that is the biggest lesson I've learned in EMS is tomorrow may never come. To, this may be your last day and life is very fragile. When you see from day to day lives slipping away depending on every second. Our biggest uh, enemy I guess you could say is time. The lesson is difficult to forget for Mercy Air paramedic Brett Spurrier. On the helicopter we typically see traumatic injuries. Um, car accidents uh, be the main main um, type of injury we see. As soon as a crew here gets a phone call from dispatch, they must be airborne within five minutes. And inside the chopper, a paramedic, a registered nurse alongside the pilot will be heading towards this emergency situation right now. We're on our way to India. As we fly a thousand feet above the Coachella Valley, Brett and his crew learn a teenager with possible spinal injuries is waiting to be airlifted from a local elementary school. The kids get through, um, definitely. Those, those are the hardest calls to deal with. Um, they're emotional for everybody. The kid was riding a, an ATV, a four-wheel a quad, um, was riding up a steep hill, um, fell off the back of the quad, rolled down the hill, um, and ended up um, face down in the sand. Uh, the quad rolled down behind him and landed on his back. How's he doing? Doing all right. Still hurt. We give him some morphine for pain. After landing on the roof of Desert Regional Medical Center, this father of two can't help but worry about his own kids. Since I do see what happens regularly, daily, to people, I'm quite paranoid about my own kids as well. I'm very protective. Soon it's back in the sky. The ride back to home base, the Banning Airport, becomes an inevitable time of reflection. Well, I look at people that are riding in the back of my helicopter and realize that, and wonder, yeah, they woke up this morning and didn't realize that today was their last day. And they had no idea. It was a normal morning for them. And once again, Brett's reminded how fragile life is. So before he closes his eyes at the end of the day, Brett hopes for that normal morning. But of course, miracles are always welcome.